guys, guys and guys and all the people from Beautyland and today guys finally hallelujah hallelujah I'm back with uh, a first impression uh, review or haul video or whatever you want to call it I know I always give you the opportunity to pick up the name for my videos because you know my English is not very good looking sorry but finally I'm here to show you guys all the uh, Italian brands that I got when I went back to Italy I'm gonna show you my favorite piece of uh, makeup that I got from these Italian brands you will love this video if you are into makeup if you are really a shopaholic or a beauty guru or, or whatever you would like to categorize yourself keep watching Let's get straight into these uh, products because honestly I cannot wait to show you guys first uh, makeup brand and it's actually it's not a makeup brand it's a cosmetic pharmaceutical brand uh, the name is Colistar and, uh, Colistar is a professional supplier of hair body and skincare products and they also have a makeup uh, range obviously and actually I can compare this to give you an idea with Clinique this brand has been on the market for 30 years I was not even born when I mean I was born yeah I cannot shit I am 31 but anyway I was a, a baby you know the first thing I got is this smoothing filler makeup uh, base primer it's also a mattifying um, primer and this is good quality stuff guys I mean I'm not recommending you guys uh, just an ordinary regular brand they were the first inventing the uh, bronzer the compact uh, bronzer uh, product. Uh, they have done a lot of amazing stuff that you probably um, could see in many many uh, professional and uh, very famous makeup brands. What you didn't know is that they were the one inventing the product because they are uh, like proper chemistry you know they have the proper laboratory. If you have not seen this brand before in your local shops uh, in your country or wherever I know most of my uh, viewers are from uh, Canada, USA and England so I will leave the links for the shops where you can buy all these products that I'm gonna show you today uh, down below in the description box so this primer is amazing it's actually very very small uh, packaging is only 15 mil but you only need a tiny little bit in your areas that you want to cover your uh, fine lines or your pores or whatever and obviously this is uh, around the nose under your eyes and that's it so from the same brand uh, Colistar I got this eye primer what you can say about a eye primer that we don't know because you know there is tons of eye primers on the market but as I was saying before this is a leading pioneer uh, brand this brand has received tons of tons of awards uh, because of the innovate formula for all these products so you want to get a step forward and you want to start uh, start trying good quality really good quality stuff you probably would like to look up for this I'm pretty sure you won't be disappointed if you are really into high quality products so that's the second brand that I'm bringing to you guys today this brand called Pupa and Pupa is Latin for doll so Pupa doll if you want to feel like a doll you better look out for this uh, brand makeup brand called Pupa on this brand you can find uh, from makeup to uh, fragrance to uh, skincare and body care bath and after bath line of products and this brand is a number one uh, best seller in Italy so if you never heard of this uh, brand before you should look out for this as well price and quality relationship is the best super super affordable you can find Pupa in like 70 countries around the world and it's been up since 1976 so it's like this is good quality makeup made in Italy they do the most pigmented lipsticks eyeshadow and the best and also the packaging is super cute and I'm gonna start with this face highlighter that I got and this is a brand new collection that they came up like a month ago they have a lab as well in Paris so uh, when I uh, say Puba I usually think of Bourjois Paris because they're actually quite the same they affordable makeup great quality great prices so that's the same thing and it's actually it's not a regular highlighter you could see like it looks like a bronzer but it's not you can use it in the whole uh, face and body it's up to you if you like shimmer or not because the color is actually like a skin tone color you can use it uh, as well as a bronzer or as a highlighter it's amazing and I'm gonna do a swatch for you guys this is the color it's very very pretty 
And I swear that the sign is super super uh, cute, honestly. During the day I won't recommend you this because it's actually very very shimmer. But for night, uh, you know, shoot some picture or going out is amazing. I love this. And the second thing that I got from Puba is a silky baked uh, face powder because it's been worth only 10 pounds and I think my skin is a combination to oily skin and I usually have uh, breakdowns of oil and shiny even after half an hour one hour wearing my makeup and after I fix and set my makeup with this powder it's like a miracle honestly I'm so in love with this powder and with this product I've got a couple of blushes from Pupa because they're, they're super pigmented guys this is the most amazing and beautiful pink color that I have ever witnessed uh, Pupa means doll in Latin but I feel like a doll when I wear this a luminous blush like a doll luminous blush You can look like a dog, but in a minute time you can look like a clown too. So you won't take that risk, you better, you know, keep a light hand. Um, and this one was the number 202. And I'm gonna go to show you guys the second one that is actually a matte blush. Just a random coral color, but as well the quality and the texture is amazing. These two blushes have been my daily must wear for the last months. I'm loving this. I also use it on my previous videos. If you haven't watched my previous videos, by the way, after you finish this video, no, no, jump there. <laughs> Hashtag, I'm, I'm too much. From Pupa, I got a couple of lipsticks and uh, the price of these lipsticks is like 12 pound, more or less. The first one that I got is uh, number 135. These are a mix between uh, creamy, buttery, uh, moisturized lipstick and very, very long lasting lipstick. So they all united together, like, you know, <laughs> the perfection of it in this lipstick, honestly. And I'm gonna do a swatch for you guys as well. Okay, can we take a minute to appreciate how pretty is this color? And honestly, in between like 30 uh, different colors, I picked the most beautiful one. Oh my god, I'm the best, honestly. And the second color that I picked is the number 150. 150 next, please. I don't know, honestly, I like better when, you know, when they name the lipsticks or the pros with names. Like, you know, uh, Rosy or, you know, Hawaiian, Mojito, I don't know, Piña Colada. <laughs> One five zero next to me. <laughs> okay. okay, guys, you gotta know that my daughter is behind the camera and she's almost dying because I say one five zero next, please. Honestly, you should know me by now. I'm the mom. Really, I'm trying to do a professional video here. Why are you laughing? Honestly, you're distracting me. That it looks red, to be honest, but it's it's not probably you know the, the proper glam bump uh, Marilyn Monroe. Uh, red is actually a summery red. Let's call it this this way and I'm gonna do a swatch for you as well. You can see it's not a regular red. It's actually it's between a coral color and orangey red. The last but not least uh, makeup brand uh, from Italy and this is the best. I left it for last because I, I love leaving things for last. The best things for last. I don't know why. I'm very very excited guys to recommend to you and introduce you this brand because you soon will start hearing a lot about this brand. It's called Nuba. And Nuba I think, if I'm not wrong, I think once I heard that it's uh, an uh, ancestor uh, tribe from Africa or something like that because uh, in 1976 uh, when this uh, professional super famous makeup artist from Italy she decided to uh, do her makeup brand uh, she was uh, so fascinated and in love with the colors of Africa and stuff. So she uh, first she focused her makeup uh, range or line on this. But after little by little, obviously she started to expand the uh, makeup brand. And in Italy, it's very well famous too. But the thing is, it took a while, many many years, uh, for this brand to finally expand uh, around the world. I don't know why. Probably they didn't have the funds or it was not popular at the very first. I can assure you it's gonna really be the most expensive and famous high quality makeup brand. And I say expensive, I'm afraid yes, it is expensive, real expensive. And when I say expensive, it's even more expensive than MAC uh, pros, than NARS, than Chanel, than Dior. This is the best quality makeup that I have uh, that I ever came across 
and I ever touched and I have ever used and I feel bad to recommend you guys a very very expensive uh, makeup brand but uh, if you are really into makeup and you never have a expensive uh, makeup on your makeup collection or you are very young or whatever don't feel bad you just need to start having you know the idea or the information that you need and in the future when you are ready to step forward and start uh, using uh, great quality makeup uh, professional makeup you probably will have buying this Nuba makeup. You know NARS or MAC of this professional makeup. Uh, this is beyond that. This is just beyond that. This is a packaging and as you can see it's very very similar to the NARS packaging. It's actually look like a dupe from the NARS packaging but it's not a dupe. This uh, brand, makeup brand was invented a long time before NARS. NARS was not even you know on the market the reason why this um, makeup brand has become very very popular in the last year I have to say is because the best selling country of this brand for some reason is guess what guess which country dubai <laughs> so all the people passing through dubai or stopping in the airport or staying there or living there they love nuba and you can find it anywhere in dubai anywhere so uh, you know people in dubai they do have money so that's why a lot of people are getting to know this brand now i was reading some blogs online and there's people seeking desperately uh, where to buy this uh, makeup products in many many countries and i know and i read uh, on a blog that you can some countries they do have already uh, nuba they have on um, sweden uh, holland uh, even the usa but uh, in many many websites and almost all the countries you can buy Nuba. I'm gonna start showing you guys this uh, mini palette and the name is Quattro because it means four in Italian uh, language so this is a only four eyeshadow mini palette. The best quality uh, eyeshadow that I never use guys honestly there is no like oh my god it's so pigmented oh my god it's so creamy oh my god it's so buttery actually this is just good this is just beyond be high quality uh, makeup and I'm gonna show you how pretty is this one the tiny mirror here and also two uh, shadow brushes here but you know the very classic one so this one is the number 602 and it got these four colors orange a black a red I don't know if you can see the hints of shimmery on this orange color but they all do have a hints of shimmery on it the first application pff, that's it boom this is explosion of color I was shocked because I always knew about this brand when I tried myself, it was like, oh my goodness, this is real. This is actually, <laughs> this is for real. You probably know by now that I'm a beauty guru or, a, you know, chopaholic or a makeup lover or whatever. And I do have my quite a few uh, eyeshadow palettes. So what's the point to have a huge eyeshadow palette from Nuba? Since this only four is $56. Now, you can imagine I'm lucky enough to have even two mini uh, palettes from Nuba. And this is the second one and the number is 621 and I'm gonna try to do a swatch for you honestly as you can see I'm not even touching hardly I'm just gonna touch very gently and you will see here it is look how pretty is this grey color or silver color I don't know and this is my favorite honestly from this mini palette is this uh, light coral color and I love this color to highlight my uh, eyebrow bone this is like proper creamy battery, I don't, I don't know, it's you need to have one of, one piece of uh, Nuba makeup brand on your makeup collection if you are really into makeup. And the other thing that I got from Nuba, and I only got three things because, as I say, very very expensive, I'm saying this is the most unique uh, blush that I have on my makeup collection right now. And look at this color, take a look at this. This is the number 47. Uh, and it's a blush bubble is the name yeah so this is a, like a coral color it's very unique in the texture and the, and the color itself is like the most pretty and beautiful and this is the one that I'm wearing today using just a hint on your cheek it will give you, you know, this tan uh, fresh hefty good looking that I'm loving at the moment that I, I look I look great today is it this is why <laughs> this is why because I use this uh, blush today this is all the makeup brands guys so we uh, talk about the Colistar which is the cosmetology pharmaceutical products and also about Pupa which is the number one best selling in Italy uh, it's the representation of Italian makeup and also about this Nuba which is the most expensive uh, makeup on the market at the moment I will leave you all the links down below where you guys can shop in the USA 
in England or in Canada. You don't necessarily need to show up straight away. You just start, you know, getting more confident with the products, checking the this website, the products, the prices and stuff. And if you have any questions, you can always leave me the comment down below and I will be back to you as soon as I can. See you on my next video. Stay rock. Five star kisses to you all. Ciao, ciao. <laughs> Checking in for the remix. You know they had a 75 Street Brazil. Well, this year's gonna be called Cayocho. <laughs>